Uh, I've been in Pando for the past 10 years. Looking at Pando, when they come out, the parliamentary candidates, when they come out, whatever thing that they are going to say is what I'm going to listen to and then see if uh, it is necessary for me to vote for them, that is where I'll go vote for them. But if they don't come out with anything that will bring development to Pando, I am not sure I'm going to vote for them. Anyone that will come with any developmental issues that concerns Pando, I'll vote for. Because Pando has been an old uh, municipality. It has been there for long. Pando has been there. Peki is out of Pando, Hohwe, all over to Rara. And Pando is still the same. So I need somebody who will come out with a great change. Somebody who wants Pando to have a different face. If you are not a child, you are not a son of me. The only key of the father is that I will throw it down. I will not play in a meal. I will not play in the school view. I will not supply all that is school view. I will not be able to go. 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 I will not be não por vou me afogar no lacie me não é no vídeo vídeo agora na minha chave não agora na minha chave nem me chamo nem letico ire nem não letico por ele não é a vida vida agora não quer dizer o avoi não quer pôr me aon de de ter me aon é tá me dirigir o grande si não o sítio por na mira de lá jomi é tá me a dar co é de lá viu o mar dar co vivi aí me ba me tocou as nossas baí o acho é boaí Nie kizungu ande nie gama kwa chovu e jicho la kumtaji meyio me a gaki magofu lenu. Doctor kifu maji ya makpo mbere makpo ba m oje na ne gome ne mi la si m b b b o afodi kwa o tu ne mi kwa dopo kaka in maji eza i kito mo vwa le fude ne mi no taflati na dole mi atufi alo afodi mi atufi ala mi chovu moto ne mi afeme. Tato tuwa kifu maji ma kwa fe kada da ni vile no jagba tu mo desi ada no fuho nemi nemi desi afu kada wenye do ke atande jipo nemi bemi atandoa ba dako gako pende unchele ole kari de street light de ni jipe kari de mega semoto ko kona kito me fole kwa yeye tu rode hehe viviti wa le fimi fimi wa bonye kari de kiana u na umenye moto fe kari de ole koko ya wagaba na deplu no zoi kona gbero mecha fole fimi viviti afeye yeye ole fimi che no zoi fimi che no va de fimi weche jo cho kona na je jo cho jo gore kada dala covid galafe vare ona mi va tri line me vu keke to ba do viviti ni mi le mi le funa oji kwa che gare keme le vava Tadi, no jawab banyak truk berkena ceri, no dorang minat minat zon, no nak mide, dia jomi bergabung, don't say mila mnya pasi cah cah me, jomi tengah vote, kau pernah mnya fe MC ke pula vide, la bagba jam tu, mau kau nama mau ke tu fe utai zio, meten dia, mau tu meten dia, Fadia Street, alu lau lau ni, eh, apa tu le de de fe fe de mau pa, the government, ni don't say. Mais donnez, il dit. Mais pourquoi c'est un job C'est un job, toi qui veux pas aller. On est dans la vie, les within spirit qui les met là. J'ai fait cette review là. On est doux, free. Et les coclos les met. Nous sommes à nous les met. On est doux, nous sommes en taxi. On est doux, free. Quand on nous met quelque chose, on est encore bête, galade. Nous disons, viré, viré, nani. Il me coûte chassis. Kau mian fe doa ni doa ni ni awak sih be, nana la kaya kaya for, ayi ayi mah tu tu yang dekat mah beli le wong. Life is correct. Mepon je je, beli bo, le nana beli MC ope, dog yo wana ni oleh depan do, mepon bo. Kaka anto awo, engkau bayi kie kabala. Light is really, le kalau gue desi ada me, kau nade si ada me, ada kadina mi. Fifi, mi wu gento e, tai ba ba le ba bu mana mi ine de de, tai e pong kong be i, bli ba le na na o o kong kong kile me, rado. We held with the translation. It just hits a different chord when you can understand the language direct. But that's the voters' voice. Uh, from Pando, Doctor Kwesi Amachibo. I think is a political scientist with the KNUST. He joins us via Zoom. Good morning to you. Uh, Dr. Amachibwating, thanks for your time this morning. Good to have you. Uh, 
Uh, good morning, and it's a pleasure to be here. Okay, great. And, and uh, I, I really hope that you were monitoring, but how is important is this question that we put to the people? Um, the voice is quite low. Let me just see. Please come again. So I'm asking how important is the question that we put to the people. And the question is, what is that one thing that you want to see changed? The reason you would vote in the December polls? Very significant, because that is all that politics is about. I mean, transformation of the state in a way that affects the lives of the people. So crucially... Uh, with every uh, cycle that we meet to decide as a people with respect to the leadership, the political leadership. I mean, we, we also looking at what has happened to us and then the way forward, what is going to happen. Um, the sort of transformation, the agenda to bring this transformation about and stuff like that. So these questions are crucial. Mm. Are the people interested in looking at their situation or looking at something within their community that they either are impressed uh, of or they, they want changed? Do we look at these things as a people when we're voting? Uh, there are a lot of arguments on this issue, but I would say that we do look, actually, irrespective of how you look at it. I mean, there are people who uh, naturally vote for particular political tradition, but that notwithstanding, they all expect, you know, some change in their life. They want change in their communities. Uh, I think it's a basic thing. People want, you know, um, some transformation, development in their lives, conditions of life and everything that pertains to it. People want that. And to the extent that we know the politicians are those whose responsibility it is to bring this change about. Anytime we go to the pools, consciously or unconsciously, this is at the back of people's mind. Mm. Are, the, are those who come to us to look for our votes, are they aware of this or are they just thinking, oh, they're just saying it because maybe somebody is going to put a microphone in front of them and is asking them the question? Are they mindful that the people really need some kind of transformation in their immediate communities? The politicians generally are mindful, but at the same time, they also um, know that people are vulnerable. So when they get into office, invariably, if the polity is not strong enough as to insist on accountability, they will do their own things. They are self-interested individuals going into their political parties, but the political party is not necessarily altruistic. Uh, I mean, they are also self-interested uh, body. But then at the end of the day, to the extent that what they do, you know, uh, I mean, comes to be premised on the ability to deliver and to, if you like, um, support the people, bring development to, you know, uh, the people, I mean, the good people of Ghana, then the linkage become established so that even in office, they know that they are continued stay you know, becomes premised on the ability to deliver. Mm. Then you have development, uh, if you like, occurring in the society. So there's some sort of tension built in democratic regimes and, and is beginning to play out in Ghana. Mm. How do we hold the politician, you know, accountable uh, to what they've said they would do? How, how do we ensure... Essentially, I guess I'm asking, how do we outsmart them? Because we know that they are usually smarter. Uh, there are various forms of accountability. Um, the people have only one uh, mechanism, and that is the uh, four-year thing, uh, what is going to happen to us, the general elections. That is the only opportunity for people to really get even with the politicians. And... Um, that is it, what is happening in Ghana, and somehow it has been happening, you know, um, politicians get voted into office, they get voted out. That is the moment of accountability at the, at the level of the people. And then there are other levels of accountability too. Yeah, but that's a shame, right? Because if that's the, uh, uh, the only option that we have, uh, then what we do is to either change you uh, at the end of the four-year tenure, because 
we see that you have not performed or you've performed and so we give you another mandate. Uh, <laughs> it's interesting to hear you say that it's a shame. Um, states, political scientists have been, you know, examining this issue, you know, over the years, and it looks like uh, the current arrangement is the best that you know could be given to people. Don't forget about the fact that there are other systems that simply don't give people the opportunity to make any choices at all. So, I mean, the current arrangement that you deride mm -hmm. is so far the best that has come to us. Um, is it that much of a shame? The four-year uh, period that we've given ourselves, I don't think it's so bad. It's okay. okay. It's okay. Politicians really know that it's really powerful. If we, if we take a look at what is happening now, the sort of, um, uh, I mean, I was going to say aggression, but I don't think aggression is a good word. A good word. Uh, President Mahama really wants to be in, in, in office. I mean, that, uh, you want to say that, I mean, he's had a, a turn. Why not allow some other person in the NDC to come? Let's ask him why he decided to come back. Then you know that the four year thing is not a shame. It's really powerful. It's telling on them. You know, politicians are afraid of that. The next elections. That is the only thing that puts fear in them. It's working. I think it's good for us for now. Well, I guess for some, for, for some of us, we're thinking, oh, the four year can get them to do things. So why don't we reduce it so we can we can see a lot more development? If you recall, President Kufa, the uh, end of his term, you know, suggested that we increase it. I think the French system has a uh, two seven year term or so, or two five year term. I don't recall the number, but they have longer period. But generally, podcasts and this argue and. This uh, a position supported by some political scientists here in Ghana, because nobody is one such people. He argues that four-year period is okay. If you if, if you allow them to hold on to political power for a long time, you will not be able to predict what they can do. And so this danger of abuse of power is such like that four-year is okay. Well, Dr. Kwesi Amachibuateng, we'll keep asking uh, these relevant questions ahead of the December uh, elections. And we thank you very much for your time this morning with us. He's a political scientist with the KNUST, Dr. Kwesi Amachibuateng. And that's it for Voters Voice. We will be in your community very soon. Stay with us when we come back as the National Science and Maths Quiz. The prelims begins today in the Great Arkan region. We're live from the venue.